Welcome to a beautiful autumn day here in Connecticut. Uh, absolutely letter perfect. And over the weekend, we went up to Goshen uh, on leaf peeping journey and for something else. Two things actually. Goshen is home to Nodines, which is an absolutely outstanding smokehouse. Uh, yeah, I just can't say enough about this place. They uh, smoke cheeses, smoke sausages, uh, jerky, uh, everything. And of course, what I really go up there for is they have outstanding Irish bangers. Now, in addition to no dines, there is a winery uh, in Goshen uh, that I love to, to, to visit, usually once a year, at least once a year. Uh, and I go there, uh, it's hospitable, the people are wonderful, and we can taste some wines that uh, I think are a little bit different, uh, which is why I go there. Um, I usually get a mixed case of white wine. And, um, which is, may sound a little bit counterintuitive if you know me because I love white burgundy. And my go-to white wine uh, that's more affordable are Loire Valley whites. Things like Sancerre and Puy Fumé, which are Sauvignon Blanc based, or Vouvray, Chenin Blanc, and then Muscadet. I just love those white wines. And there are other white wines that I enjoy as well uh, from Italy. So I certainly have enough to choose from uh, when it comes to white wine. But why do I go to Sunset Meadow Vineyards, besides it being just a, a wonderful place to visit? It's because they have things that are not those things. <laughs> they have varietals that, uh, that are atypical. Uh, so, for example, today I'm going to be tasting their Cayuga White. Uh, they, I also picked up some of their Vidal Blanc. I picked up something that they call their Route 66, which is some cockamamie blend. And I even picked up their Riesling and Chardonnay for a mixed case. But it's this type of wine that, that intrigues me the most. Because again, you just, you just don't sort of see it out there. It's a nice way to supplement the things that I already know, that I already have. And Cayuga White is interesting. Unlike the other varietals that we typically see in the Northeast uh, or in Eastern United States in general, are a crossbreed of some type of European uh, varietal blended uh, with other things. To make, to make the varietal better suited to our climate and soils. Cayuga White is actually a project made uh, at an uh, uh, agricultural station in Geneva, New York, Cayuga being one of the Finger Lakes up there. Mm. It's fun. It has this combination of both bright, fresh fruit without it being sweet, and then a little hint of what I would call garden herbs. Clean, dry finish, nice touch of minerality at the back. Excellent. And it's certainly a worthwhile visit uh, to go up to visit this, uh, this winery. It's in Goshen, Sunset Meadow Vineyards. Nice people, nice wines to try for a change. I haven't tried their reds uh, for a couple of years. Maybe that's worthy a, a, a look-see as well. But in the meantime, this wine, terrific. And I think I'll serve this with chicken pot pie tonight. Thanks.